The story begins with a Fred named Kitty who is having fun with a lion named Rory, as his best friend. They were playing golf with the help of a stick, when his wife Boney comes there and tells him that, he's supposed to bring water but he is doing chill here. There the queen elephant of that forest comes to him and says that this year there is no water in his rivers, whereas every year till this time the water used to come in the rivers. Don't know what this year happened. From here there is a scene shift and we see a chicken named Charles which is about to turn into his dinner only in a while. But he somehow escapes from there by freeing himself. He jumps out of his shift and gets into a small boat, where he meets some other animals on that boat. All those animals had to leave their homes and run away because of humans. They were going in search of such a place, where humans have not reached yet. There is a mature turtle, who tells them that they have come to know from migratory birds that there is a place named Pandora, where humans have not yet stepped. He tells them that he will help them in taking them all to that place. The queen here is in very tension that even the food stocks with them are running out and have dried up. And if the situation continues like this, it will be difficult for them to survive. Fred was moving in search of water. By taking some water for his family, some distance away the group of Buffalo and Riano are fighting among themselves to drink water first. Ignoring them, Fred starts filling water in his bottle directly from the pond there. When he sees Riano and Buffalo, they stare at him angrily. Here the Fred's son Junior was praising his dad a lot in front of his friends. Then they all see that Fred is running away with the water. And behind him is a group of buffaloes. Junior becomes happy that his dad is bringing it for him even after facing so many troubles. But because of those buffaloes, Fred's water gets washed away. Junior's friends start making fun of him. He gets very sad. Fred goes to his home but Junior is very angry and he tells to Fred that he is not his dad from today. Because Fred unable to bring water in front of his friends. Fred goes to his friend and says that he has to go in search of his water. Because his family needs water and he also has to show his son Junior that he is not a loser. Rory tells him that he is not going anywhere. Because he is very happy here. Rory tells him that you have to cross the valley of death when you proceed by following the river. Hearing this, Fred gets very scared. He asks him what is this valley of death. Rory tells him that many years ago he went to that valley. If any animal goes there then they will not come live. Rory says that he cares about his life. That's why he can't come with him. After a while Rory sees that Fred has gone alone. Fred begins his search. And after some time he reaches near the valley gate. There he finds some vultures. Who warns him before going to the valley. But still Fred dares to go inside the valley. That place seems to him very awkward. Then after a while he hears some scary voice. He looks back and becomes very happy because his friend Rory was there. Those people run quickly and start crossing that valley. But after some time a big black panther is seen in Fred. Who is moving towards him. But suddenly he sees that the leopard has started running away from fear. He doesn't understand anything. That's when he looks behind him. There was a big polar bear. Because of whose fear he ran a leopard. Rory also come there. At night they all rests for some time. There Rory tells Fred that many years ago he had come to here with his brother. But suddenly someone killed his brother. He saw a different creature there that day. Which is called the human. Everyone picks wake up in the morning. The bear tells him that now he cannot go anywhere else. Because he's so tired. Point two animals Toby and McGuire go to find water along with Fred and Rory. The four of them move on from there and very soon they reach the end of that valley. They all see a big dam there. The water of their rivers was stopped because of the same dam. They all go to the top of the dam hiding. There they see that all the water of the river has been kept in prison by someone here. There was a hotel named Eden Paradise near the dam. Where today many people of the country were coming to attend meeting. The owner of that hotel welcomes the delegates who come there to his hotel with his pet monkey Toto. Here with the help of a water board, they reach the hotel. They all go inside the hotel and start having fun. Fred and all reach there in the conference room. Seeing this, all the people there get very scared. He immediately calls the owner of the hotel. The owner gives voice to the hunter there. The hunter comes there with his gun and starts shooting Fred. Fred falls into the pool there to escape from him. But that hunter presses the button there. Due to which Fred falls out through the damn pipe. Monkey saved them from all. He hides them in a room of that hotel. But together they completely ruin that hotel room. Toto comes to explain to them that by doing this they putting his life in danger. Fred tells him that they cannot hide here. Toto tells them that they have to open the floodgates of the dam. Due to which water will flow back into their rivers. Toto reaches the dam motor room with everyone. 
Fred starts trying to open the floodgates when the hunter comes there and suits the Rory and makes him unconscious. Fred presses a button there, due to which the floodgates start opening and that too starts falling in it and flows out of it. Toby and McGuire also come out through him. That hunter quickly closes the floodgate and reaches them with his car to kill them all. They all start running, he is following them with his car, but they turns his car over with the help of both turtles. Fred tells all the other animals there that he should go and talk to all the animals and call them all here and break this dam. They all go back and collect all the animals and tell how humans have kept the water coming into his forest and prison in the dam. And if they do not do anything now, then those people will end very soon. And the next day we see a herd of animals moving towards the dam but there was no group of buffalo and reno with them because they refused to accompany them. All of them had reached close to the animal dam. Then he comes there sitting in a plane. He is going to fire a missile on them. But then he sees that behind him. He starts hitting her and because of accidentally pressing the button, missile goes inside the pipe of the dam but it does not burst. Somehow makes that plane land. Maya, the son of the owner of that hotel, frees Rory from the cage and here Fred asks his animals to attack him with the stones. Everyone starts trying to break the dam. That's when they see that the team of Buffalo and Rhino has come to their aid. They start breaking that dam. The dam was starting to move a bit now, but that was not enough. Then Fred sees a high up there. He immediately hits her with a wooden stick like golf and it goes straight and hits that missile in the dam's hole and it explodes. Dam starts breaking now. Water starts pouring out of it and finally the entire dam breaks down. Animals start flowing in it and going towards the forest. Fred was also curious. And after that day there was never any shortage of water. Fred's wife and his son Junior were also happy to see Fred. And story ends here. Viewers if you like this story then hit subscribe button and please share my videos. See you in next story.